Trevor Seaver was here outside Modesto's Church of the Brethren last December when family members called police reporting that the man had sent them threatening text messages. Within seconds of arriving to that call, police body camera video shows former Modesto police officer Joseph Lamontia firing the fatal shots that took the life of 29-year-old unarmed Trevor Seaver. His death has sparked community outrage. ABC 10 spoke with Seaver's family at protests this winter. And we want this to stop. We don't want another family to have to bury their brother, their son, their grandson, nephew. And following an investigation into the officer's deadly actions. The board concluded that Officer Joseph Lamantia's conduct and use of deadly force against Trevor Seaver in the December 29th incident was in violation of department policies, procedures, and training. In a rare decision, Modesto police has fired La Montilla. An investigation into his record found he was involved in four previous on-duty shootings as a Modesto police officer. He was cleared for all but one, which remains under investigation. The former officer is facing one count of voluntary manslaughter for killing Seaver. The attorney representing the Seaver family says that's not enough. We would all like the charges to be stronger, but we're grateful for the charges that have been pressed. We'll allow them some peace, at least for the time being. Now we're told that the family of Trevor Seaver watched as that former officer was arraigned in Stanislaus County Court today where he pled not guilty. He's being held on $100,000 bond. We have reached out to Mr. Lamontia's attorney. We have not heard back. Mr. Lamontia is due back in court in June.